is your boy B minus and welcome back to the B minus channel. I have been away for almost a week now. You might be wondering, did you die or something? Or what happened? Did you get kidnapped? Long story short, guys, uh, my PC that I do all my editing, that I run all you know my recordings through, it crapped out. It's you know six, seven years old, and it's an old rig, and basically the components of it are dead. Have no fear, I've ordered new parts, I'm gonna go ahead and try to get it repaired as quickly as possible and it will be up and running in a couple of days, so uh, wish me luck on that. I'm actually recording this on uh, my laptop here, which is even older, I think this is about 8 years old? So yeah, uh, hopefully I can actually edit this stuff afterwards. Fingers crossed that I can get all that stuff set up for you and be uh, back to making videos in about, you know, like 2-3 days. So that's a quickie channel update now to give you guys a little bit of a preview of what I'm going to be doing at the start of FIFA 16. I will be doing two main career modes. And of course the first one you guys probably already know. It's the most popular, you know, career mode on this channel. And that of course is going to be the Pokemon career mode. It's going to be brand new. I'm thinking I'm probably going to be doing it with Barcelona again. Maybe Real Madrid, maybe Manchester United. It depends on which team that I'll be starting out with. But it's going to be bigger. It's going to be even crazier rules. And I think the main thing that's going to get you guys hyped is it's going to be a super league in the BPL. And the reason why I'm going to do that is that there are four divisions in the EPL. And what that allows me to do is make the most super of super leagues. So basically, for you guys who are familiar with the Pokemon Crew Mode, every single team that we play, we potentially get to steal a player off of that roster. Now, what happens is, after one season, that can get a little bit stale. But I realized that what's kind of stale about that is after one season, you're gonna be playing the same teams over and over again. So what I thought is, we go ahead, we take a low-rated team, and then we put them in the bottom division, the fourth division, but I feel like every one of those divisions Divisions with different teams, but the best teams from all over Europe. So in the fourth division, you'll be playing up against the likes of, I don't know, like a, a Sporting Lisbon and those kind of teams, and then you work your way up through like the Bayer Leverkusen's, the Ajaxes, and then you eventually get up to, you know, like the big boys like the Bayern and the Manchesters. It is going to be ridiculous, guys. So guys, look for that for my FIFA 16 Pokemon Super League career mode. It is going to be fantastic, and yes, we are going to be doing Nuzlocke rolls. And the second crew mode that I'm going to be doing is one in the BPL and the team that I chose, I go with a mid-tier team and the team that I thought, you know, was very, very interesting and I was very intrigued by, you know, the transfers that they made over the past couple seasons is Sexy Sexy Stokelona. Taking great young talent that's kind of a little bit cast off or surplus at, at the massive teams of Bayern and Barcelona and I think I'm going to continue that in that career mode. In the same vein, I'm going to be looking at ex-Barcelona and ex-Bayern Munich players maybe. You know, or maybe some of their youngsters, maybe look at a Munir, look at a Halilovic, look at, uh, you know, the American Julian Green. So hopefully you guys are down for those two choices to start off career mode. And have no fear, if you don't enjoy those two, we will be getting into new and better stuff as we go along. I got a million more ideas for collaborations with other YouTube channels. So it's going to be really, really exciting. And I have saved up and I purchased an Xbox One, which means I will be getting early access, guys. So you can expect episode 1 of the Pokemon League and Stoke Luna out before the game even releases in America. So yeah, that's pretty much a quickie update on the channel and my plans for the start of FIFA 16. And uh, I'm basically going to close it out by doing a little bit unboxing, guys. So you guys can go ahead and click up right now if you want. But uh, if you'd like to stick around, I'm going to be doing an unboxing for this little sucker right here, which is Marvel Corpse. Uh, this is Marvel Collector Corpse for Secret Wars. And uh, it's a little bit of busy. I haven't seen what is inside now, but usually you get like a cool toy. It's kind of like Loot Crate, but for Marvel heads like myself, and I'm a big, big Marvel guy. As you can see, the box art is super, super tight. Like they have comic books. And on the outside is female Thor, which is pretty badass. I'm gonna go ahead and put this down. Right off of the bat, he gets Marvel Corpse Pin, which is just, uh, I guess it's, I think that's the new Iron Man, I guess. And then over here is a new Captain America. If you guys didn't know, Captain America is now black in the Marvel Universe. Very progressive. Very progressive. Here we are. We're going to be opening it up right here. I'm going to see what else is Ooh! Right off of here, we're getting a t-shirt. Let's go ahead and open this up. And it's like, they're all the main Marvel characters from Secret Wars, but they're all in the same uh, vein of these Funko Pop figurines. So you can see right there, 
There's a female Thor at the top, Miles Morales, Spider-Man in the black red suit. There we go. We got uh, we got Black Captain America, and I guess that's the new Iron Man, like a silver Iron Man. Kind of reminds me of War Machine. So we're gonna go ahead and further down looking here. Ooh, here we go. We get Secret Wars, female Thor in the Funko Pop vein. Very nice, very nice right here. And oh, oh my God, right here. Female Thor Funko Pop figurine, and that isn't it, boys. That is not it. You get two Funko Pops in this one, and you get black and red suit, Miles Morales, Spider-Man. Oh my goodness, goodness, this is like the most ethnically progressive Marvel box loot crate that I've ever gotten. <laughs> so there you guys go, an amazing, amazing Marvel Collector Cards. I've enjoyed every single one of them. <laughs> And I'm not sponsored by them. I do not get any codes. So, yeah. So, yeah. That's pretty much it for me. Hopefully, you guys enjoy the update. And you haven't unsubbed yet. I will be getting out more videos out to you as soon as possible, guys. It's just, uh, you know, my PC is, like, right next to me right here. And they're just, like, you can see that I'm just, like, tearing it apart and trying to reassemble it. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully, uh, things go well. I I've never made a computer before. But, um, hopefully, I can get things up and running to you guys as soon as possible, uh, because I really do miss it, I really do miss making videos and respond to you guys on YouTube and, uh, really talk to you guys in the community. And it's been, it's been a rough week, I, I, I can't, I can't lie, but, um, it's been, uh, I felt a little bit lost, you know, like, without being on YouTube, and, uh, hopefully I can get back on there and talk with you guys, because I feel like you guys are my, my online family, you know? I, I, I need the weirdos back in my life, is, is the best way to see it, so. Yeah, hopefully we get all that stuff back up, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for me. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful day. Remember, stay yourself, stay humble, and be weird.